Welcome to BTBS. This is Jay. Today I will talk about the way to configure KVM on Fedora 28 for OpenShift version 4. There is a documentation from OpenShift installer Git repository to set up KVM, but I will also provide you Ansible script for that. This repository has all information. Prerequisite needs one package, the Golang. However, if you already did it how to build next generation OpenShift installer, you already have it. So I will skip it. The manual way. I already told you there is official documentation to set up KVM, but it is manual way. You need to copy and paste one by one. Here is the Ansible playbook. Originally, this playbook is from this PR. However, this is not merged yet. So I cannot send the PR after some issue fixed. Basically, I copied the original playbook and updated it. If you want to see the original file, please see the PR. Okay, now let's configure the KVM. This environment has Golang, but it doesn't have a lib but. However, I already test that Ansible script on my host. That's why there are several packages left. First of all, I will show you Golang version here. I will clone my Git repository. I will go to temp directory and I will clone it. And then I will go to the repository. There is demos and OCP4 and libbut and configure KVM. So here there is a config underscore KVM YAML file. So at here, I will execute that Ansible playbook. It will install several packages for KVM. Then set it up some stuff on the OS. Okay, it's done. So after it finished, you are ready to install OpenShift version 4. Thank you.